Hi, this is Taylor Otwell, and this is just a quick informal video to show you how the Lumen uh, benchmark numbers are uh, calculated on the Lumen homepage. There's been some questions about how that's done, and it's actually really simple. Anyone can recreate it in just like five minutes. So I just wanted to show you how that works, okay? Let me clear out my terminal here. And basically, I've got three installations. I've got a Silex app, a Slim app, and a Lumen app. And these are all running on Homestead. So anyone can recreate this environment really easily. Um, I've allocated two gigabytes of RAM to the Homestead VM. And basically, all you want to do is just set up the most basic installation of these um, micro frameworks that you can. So you can see the Silex app. It just returns Hello Silex from a basic route. Uh, the Slim app says Hello Slim. And the Lumen app just says Hello Lumen. So these are the most simple applications you can make for any of these frameworks. Um, basically just the demo examples on the front page of the framework documentation. All right, so now what you want to do is once you have those cloned down, I'm just going to, let's do Silex first. And I just want to optimize the Composer autoloader because that does make a pretty big difference um, in these benchmarks. And then on my VM, I'm going to use Apache Benchmark, which can be installed using Apache 2-utils on your uh, using the apt package manager. And I'm going to do AB for 10 seconds, uh, 10 concurrent request, and then just put in the URL, which is silex.app for me. And you can see if I hit that in my browser, I'm getting that hello silex. So if I hit that, in 10 seconds, it will come back and it will give you a lot of numbers. And one of the numbers is the amount of requests per second that it was able to execute on this app. And uh, we'll see what that number was. All right, for Silex, it looks like that was 952 requests per second on my machine. Now, this number is going to vary um, depending on, even depending on what software you have running at the time um, or your machine specs. So this is, don't you're not going to see this exact number, but... In terms of proportions and like percentages, it should be fairly similar. All right, so that is Silex, 952 requests per second on this machine. And that's really fast. I mean, that's blazingly fast. So I don't want to make it sound like that is slow. Okay, so let's do a Slim next. So uh, that says, hello, Slim. Let's go ahead and run basically the same command, Slim.app. And let's make sure before we run this that... Um, we do have the composer dump auto load optimize. All right, so that's optimized. And if we check it in the browser, it is returning hello slim. And we can just run that for 10 seconds. And it's going to come back with similar numbers so we can see what the requests per second were. And it should be pretty fast. This is slim three. So this is actually not quite released yet. It's the latest iteration of slim. And you can see this is a little bit faster than Silex. This did uh, 1,254 requests per second, almost 55. Uh, so again, very fast, faster probably than you will ever need for any of your PHP applications, but just for the sake of demonstration, um, uh, we'll show it. All three of these frameworks are, are really just stupidly fast. So, um, all three are going to be pretty performant. All right. So now for Lumen, let's go ahead and check that out. Again, this just returns hello Lumen from the default route. And I've got it set up at lumen.app. And you can see there's the Hello Lumen. And we will just um, do the same thing, optimize the autoloader. All right, and then we are ready to run the same command for Lumen. So we'll just change this URL to Lumen and fire that off. And we can see how many requests per second it's able to handle. And uh, it should be, I expect it to be probably in the 17 to 1900, um, sometimes up to 2000. You can see this one was 1700. So uh, for this round of tests, um, Silex was at about 950, which is a little lower than the benchmark on the website. Again, that varies depending on what all you have running. Even something as simple as having this screen recorder running can affect the benchmark numbers. Uh, the Silex or the Slim numbers were, um, I think, let's see, 1254. Again, a, a little lower than what's on the page. And then Lumen came in at 1707. So you can see that Lumen was clearly the fastest in the simple benchmark. Um, you can recreate this really easily on your own homestead box. It only takes about five seconds to uh, clone it down, optimize the autoloader, and just run this simple command. And it should give you similar benchmark numbers.